Hey guys, what's up? Nickel here from Top Motions and welcome to a brand new tutorial. Today I'll be showing you guys how to create a mopping effect with shape layers into After Effects. It's a very simple, very awesome and very useful effect when you're working with motion graphics and stuff. So before we get started, let's just have a look at what we're going to be creating today. Yep, you can see cool morphing going on right there. So now you can play around with st this stuff and make it look more cool and intricate. Now I have one more example right here. So you can see it looks pretty cool, pretty intricate and pretty awesome. You can also make a logo reveal with it. I have used the Venetian blinds to make it look more cool. You can use your ideas, make it look more creative. So I'm gonna show you the basic of this effect. So first of all, let's create a new comp. I like to keep a 1920 into 1080. Hit OK. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna right click, go to new, solid. OK. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select the shape layers. Now for stars, let's just start from a, let's see, maybe from a circle and drag it right there and hold alt control shift to make it precise and from the center right there then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go here and let's see make it a star maybe and let's just select this and do the same thing hold shift to make it look more precise and intricate i'll just keep it right there again go to this and this time i'm gonna select a polygon maybe Select this and just drag it right there. Hold shift to make it intricate. So now here I have three marks. First is the circle, second is the star, and third is the polygon. You can also you can make any shape, you know, pretty easily. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna click here and hit U two times to bring up this mask path properties, and then I'm gonna Select all these three and click on the stopwatch right there. And now you can see we have this keyframe right there. So now what I'm going to do is let's just make some space here. I'll just go to about one second and I'm going to copy the second, the second mask keyframe control C. Go on the first mask and do control V. Then I'm going to go to right, let's say two seconds. I'm going to copy the third mask keyframe control C and click on this first mask and control V and I'm gonna just delete the second and the third and BAM we are done with the morphing it was so simple now you can do this thing with any shapes any text and anything literally anything in After Effects and it's so simple you know it's pretty pretty simple you can see we have done this cool morphing now you can do this with any shape you want you can draw shapes and do this morphing so i guess this was a quick tip tutorial instead of a long tutorial and we are done with it now you, one more thing you can do is you can change the colors as they morph so let's just go and type in fill and i'm going to just drag it right here and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to keyframe the fill so let's just go to right here effects and yep we have it so I'm gonna start from let's see let's say a yellow then I'll just go to right about there and I'm gonna make it let's see a blue and at the end I'm gonna make it maybe this color okay so BAM we are done with the mo oh I'm sorry guys I forgot to keyframe it so let's just go and make it this yellow keyframe it this keyframe man I hate this stuff but it's very important go right there blue and let's go right there and just make this thing right there yeah so now we are done with it you can see it looks pretty cool you see looks pretty cool so yep that's it that's the end of the tutorial I hope this helps you in your further motion graphics project and I hope you learned something new today and thanks for watching guys.